Hello and welcome to 2 and Door Gaming and I just wanted to do this quick video showing you that the Curse Forge beta is now released and you can get a hold of it and give it a try. Uh, you will just need to go to the curseforge.overwolf.com page and you can download it for your Windows or Mac. Uh, this is the beta so not all the features are available and it may change as they get feedback but they have been working it with World of Warcraft mods for a while now so it should be pretty much close to final release um, styling this is probably more just for loadout testing so you just download that it's pretty simple uh, it'll take a little while to start up the first time what it'll do is because when you are using the twitch client the folders if you use the default folders were saved under curse rather than under twitch so it will access everything exactly the same as your twitch mod client so all of the mod packs you've already installed are here and all of the files associated with it will be available all the world files save files that sort of stuff so you won't have to copy anything or play around with the background files it'll all be there for you as you can see it's pretty similar in visual style to twitch so not much is going to change for you uh, it's still got a little download button if uh, you need to update the version and you click on that and you can read through and then doop, and continue so that's all there just as it was before uh, so you shouldn't have too much trouble switching over there's not much to learn I have noticed uh, with um, my mod pack which I need to update it's not quite as mm, user friendly so normally I would have my mod list here and um, oh no looks last time I checked it didn't have these downloads must be the second time I opened it up it's got the updates for me okay well scratch that it looks like it's exactly the same function as twitch so if you're creating your own mod pack then I guess they've ported that over too so obviously the biggest difference is over here we've got this ad section uh, as we were warned there would be ads but the ad well apparently the ad revenue is going to the like 70% it's going to the mod creators so that's a positive but you can do a little subscription to knock it out but it's not actually available at the moment they're just sort of saying it's coming now it's an interesting situation when you open up this uh, curse forge client you're actually opening up two programs there's an oval uh, Overwolf client and then the curse forge sits sorry I bumped my mic uh, the curse forge sits on top of the Overwolf so there's actually two programs going now, I haven't investigated much yet but I'm very curious as to why that is and what the functionality is what why there's a double a double platform what Overwolf is offering beyond curse forge uh, or what their future plans are so uh, even when you play around with your settings uh, see how it's got like when I close curse forge I can either just hide it or it exits or it exits both curse forge and overwolf so yeah hmm I'm not sure and so when you do startup settings like you can run it on startup I've turned that off because I got enough trouble uh, but overwolf is set on default see how it's got a whole new settings page for overwolf and you've got to change it over there if you want to turn it off so yeah it's something to bear in mind and i'll look into that if i'm just not sure exactly what overwolf is planning to have launching in the background as well are they going to have other platforms uh, i'm not sure i'll look into that anyway so there you go it's very simple to set up it looks simple to use your experience is not going to change much uh, from twitch and of course you've got other games that you can get stuff for if you have those games or not i'm purely using it for minecraft myself so if you have any questions let me know because i'll probably have that question eventually myself and uh, it'll be good to find out um, We'll see how we go i'm still happy with uh using my other um platforms but they don't let me manipulate my own mind uh my own mod pack so 
I guess I'll be using both. Okay, thanks for watching.